Hey folks, Keith with 93 Lumber coming back at you with another beer. This is Zebulon. This is a beer that I got last year, a little over a year ago. Uh, like a year and I think we went, I keep thinking we went in September, but I think it was August, end of August. Um, so I've had this for a year and a few months. Um, this is their Tokyo style Goza. It is 4.7% alcohol by volume. A tart wheat beer with a bit of umami saltiness from local white miso paste and brightened up with pickled ginger. Brewed with 100% local riverbend malts. And yeah. Uh, yeah, that's it. I think most of their bottles have that same logo. logo. Saying logo weird. But uh, usually I think the coloring's a little different depending on what it is. This has just been sitting in the fridge for, I don't know. I think I put this in the fridge basically since I got it, since I brought it back. So finally drinking it. <laughs> That is, I can't tell if there's a slight haze to it or it looks like there's some like sediment flowing around. So it may just be that. Um, but yeah, that's a light yellow, kind of pastel yellow uh, color. Half finger well, around the outside at least. That's probably about a finger of a white head. Snow white head. It looks like a Goza. Let's see what it smells like. Oh yeah, ginger. A lot of ginger in there. Um, the pickle, it, and you can tell it's pickled. It's definitely pickled. Uh, pickled ginger um, is the biggest thing. And then there's like a, just, just behind that is an uh, soft umami flavor aroma yeah there's a soft um like you can tell it's tart um aside from the uh, ginger thing but, uh let's see what it tastes like cheers that I'm going to take a few sips before I uh, say anything get get that palate acclimated The tartness is bordering on sour. It's almost mouth puckering, almost. Um, but the What I was going to say on that first sip, um, I just wanted to have a few sips before I got into it. 
Um, on that first sip, it was everything was like it was perfection. Um, after a few sips, I don't really get the umami flavor anymore. Um, and that pickled ginger is just the right level in this. Um, yeah. Ooh, that burp was very umami flavored. Um, yeah, like that first sip, the, the umami and the pickled ginger and that tartness were work so well together. I don't know if I just acclimated to the umami and now I'm not getting it as much or oh no it's there a little bit yeah yeah this is really good uh zebulon is really good amazing i wish i lived closer sometimes i feel like i follow them on instagram and sometimes they release things or they have their uh their draft list, they post a picture of their draft list and they usually have a Cascale on there. And uh, sometimes I just get the urge to just drive the 10 fucking hours down there to fucking do it. This is good. This is like, yeah, it's, it's a little more on the tart side um, or the more tart side for me. Um, like, so that could, that could come down a little bit, but, but the flavors are very nice. Yeah. You get a little bit of umami first and then, and then comes in the pickled ginger and it's, it's a very... I'm licking my lips and it's salty. I don't really get saltiness in the in the uh, beer itself. It's more of like an after after uh, not an after effect. Uh, kind of like it's not, and it's not really in the finish. It's more just like residual. I like this. Like I said, the uh, the tartness could come down a little bit for for uh, for my liking, but I mean, I think I think this is this is a great beer. This is good, very good, very nice. Excuse me. <clears throat> so yeah. Yeah, um, the uh, the nose now is a lot more salty umami. Before it was just kind of umami, yeah. But now it's it. There's a bigger saltiness to it. Hmm. Or maybe I just missed it before. I don't know. It's kind of big to miss. I don't know. I really like this. It's good. That ginger does build up a bit, cause that sip it was a little, uh, it was a little, um, it was it was getting up there as far as like overwhelming, but you know, um, but I think I think this is this is good stuff. So yeah, thanks for hanging out. Uh, hope you're doing well. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. You can like this video if you'd like to. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can follow me on Instagram. 93 Lumber. That's spelled out. 93 Lumber. We'll see you in the next one. Cheers.